I'm Georgie Bingham. This is Andrew Murray, the wise man, and Chloe <laughs> Allen, and we are learning from him. And in last week's challenge, I'm very, very reluctant to tell you that I hold out. I'm very modest indeed. Yeah. So here we are with the long part, and you have chosen an absolute stinker for us. Oh. Well, why not? It's uh, up and over the hill, yeah. um, six or seven foot above up the Mackenzie and swinging from five feet right to left. I mean, Thanks. what's difficult yeah, about that? Sounds pretty that? easy. Yeah. yeah. Go on then. <laughs> okay, long putts, well, putting full stop for me, you've got to keep stable. The top players stay very still from waist down, however you grip it, whatever the putter. Okay. So it's really key for me that you stay very still and make dead centre contact. Everybody miss hits long putts and you'd finish up halfway up the ramp and sure. 35 feet left of the flag. So long putting, keep still, Keep a rhythm and try and make dead contact uh, with the middle of the club. So every every fraction that off centre hits, you're going to lose a bit of speed and therefore a bit of um, okay. a bit of accuracy. So who's going to go first? Chloe can go first because all right. Know. Okay. So Chloe, mm -hmm. up the ramp, right to left. Just Ugh. absorb the surroundings. Okay. Yep. Okay. okay let's go for give it. This a go. Not bad. Okay. So just get your mm -hmm. line a little bit better. Sure. Okay. That was brilliant. Okay. Sorry about the ball markings. Okay, I know it's all to do with your vision. So I clack handed putt, but for longer parts, I've learned to take my hands apart. Okay. Because otherwise I generally don't tend to get near enough to a pin. Yeah, okay. That's about the right length. But if you were to see the, the video of those, both of you mm -hmm. tend to move a little bit too much from waist down and knees are going at it. If your knees are going at it, your waist is going at it. Right. You're making, you know, you're not making a dead center contact. <laughs> Okay, so as with every week, a challenge. Two for us, mm -hmm. one for one you. For and let's see how we go. I'm not so confident of holding out on this one. Ready, go on, Chloe. <laughs> okay, let's no do pressure. this. Okay, <sighs> up the ramp, right mm -hmm. to left. Well, that's a really good effort to start with. Needs yeah. to turn a bit more. Okay, okay. Let's try Watch this your one. Line. Just get your line. Okay. Up the hill, up the hill. Mm, stopped on it a little oh. bit. Oh. So ordinarily, it would take me, you know, 10 minutes to line this up mm -hmm. and everything else. But as it's a putting challenge for yes, you, Andrew. you've got to go straight I'll in. go straight at it. My juniors have got to hit it within three seconds. I'd say putting is the only area of the game where I'm actually slow. Everything else, I'm very speedy. But okay. putting, I've learned that I was very slapdash at and I've had to get a bit more concentration to be better. What a shame. Well, Andrew, with that's mine? That's all right. No, um, I'll borrow yours, yeah. Uh, for me, just too much movement in your lower half, really. Okay. Uh, and, and obviously, you're trying to talk and at the same time. But pick your line, hit it within three seconds. Please up, don't be near. Please ramp. don't be near. Oh, my goodness. Oh. And down, not oh, very no, good, but. Not very good, but Andrew's still very the good, winner. Not very good, but. <laughs> <laughs> still the winner. Oh, well. Oh, well. Got lucky again. But dead centre contact makes a difference. Well, you know.